I came to the cemetery, purchased the marker. The cemetery in turn placed the marker. Over the decades, the family of Lucille Krajewski would visit their grave to pay respects. But were they in the right place? In just the last couple of years, the family received some startling news that leaves them asking, where's Mama? 7 Investigator Jim Kurtzner looking into what appears to be a grave mistake. We found out this problem is not unique to just this family, but they still cannot get any answers. The truth is buried six feet under. Cemetery tells us one place, they've got her marked at another spot. Finding Mama inside the Cadillac Memorial Gardens in Clinton Township is still a mystery. We've visited the wrong spot for 30 years now. Lucille Krzyzewski is Mark's mother-in-law. She died back in 1985 at age 36 of pneumonia and other health complications. Mark was married to Lucille's daughter, Kim, and they have a son, Dustin. Kim passed away in 2008. Another daughter, Donna, lives in Florida and is not in good health. Lucille was originally placed here without a headstone until Mark bought this one in 1990. It was a surprise Mother's Day gift for the girls, for their mom. I came to the cemetery, purchased the marker. The cemetery in turn placed the marker. That place turned out to be dead wrong, and it was not discovered until Marvin, Lucille's husband, died two years ago. The two were supposed to be buried next to each other. The family is holding Marvin's cremains till they figure out where's mama. He's put over here and even in the wrong position. So we still yet today cannot intern him. And get this, the plot where Lucille was supposedly buried is apparently occupied and not by her. Lucille's marker is actually placed on top of a, a man Wait a minute, what? Yes. Say that again? So my mother-in-law's marker is actually placed on top of a body of a gentleman that was never marked. So who is he? Where's his family asking, where's daddy? Here's what the cemetery told mama's family. No one comes to visit him anyhow, so we're not gonna bother with it. By now you've figured out this is a lawsuit, and according to court documents, the state took over Cadillac Memorial Gardens after allegations of mishandling of funds and misappropriations of many bodies. Headstones get set sometimes in the wrong, you know, in the wrong grade. How often yeah. does that happen? Not that often. He says he was hired just two years ago to be the new guy in charge of fixing up this cemetery. He's not making these decisions. The attorney for the new company sent us a statement that says in part, the cemetery offered to have the grave site where Mrs. Krzyzewski is buried opened at no cost to the family, so an identification could be done. However, the family refused. Cadillac Memorial Gardens East is confident on the location of Mrs. Krzyzewski's grave site. The cemetery is also confident that the courts will handle this matter with utmost respect and consideration for the family and their concerns. They've gone three decades. Mm -hmm. Where's mama? They don't know. Nobody can tell us where our mother is. At. Why can't they resolve that? Mark Grabo says the family will agree to opening up the graves to resolve this as long as it's done by a third party. But the family also needs to be compensated for 30 years of visiting the wrong grave site and in the end asking, where's mama? Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. And the attorney for the cemetery also telling us Lucille's grave site has never been moved, just mismarked, as you heard Jim say. They are confident about where she is buried, but they want to prove it. But that is delayed, seeking either a court order or sign permission from Lucille's legal next of kin.